should you buy an air fryer toaster oven? Air fryer toaster ovens tend to look like larger versions of your classic toaster oven, but come with all the functionality of a toaster oven, air fryer, and even roaster combined. If your countertop already houses a toaster oven and you're wishing you had space for an air fryer, consider this the ideal more than two for own upgrade. For one thing, the shape is sleek and angular, meaning it will fit more easily into a corner and sit flush against your backsplash. And most of these combo machines are stainless steel making them very durable. While many solo air fryers are shiny plastic that can feel like it's a bit of a cheaper design. Another pro, the air fryer toaster ovens are designed to hold more food. Many of these models can fit a 12-inch pizza, 4 plus slices of bread and a whole chicken. No more batch cooking necessary, which means you can get dinner on the table for your whole family faster. We tested eight air fryer toaster ovens to find out which ones were worth it. Our top picks come from Calphalon and Breville. Our favorite air fryer toaster oven is the Calphalon air fryer oven, which is a well-rounded, attractive option that outperform the competition in every cooking task. We also like the Breville Smart of Nair Fryer, which is easy to use and offers an impressive variety of functions. Rounding out our winners is the Breville Jewel of Nair Fryer Pro, which has an app with recipes. The best air fryer toaster oven a Calphalon Performance Air Fry Convection Oven. This unit is handsome and subtle, with a classic aesthetic that doesn't feel overly trendy. It produced excellent toast and had minimal hot spots, an important consideration for baking and roasting. We like that its fry basket was able to stand alone in the unit by sliding into grooves on the side walls. Some other models required the basket to sit on a tray, which made maneuvering difficult and inhibited browning. All in all, this is a nicely sized toaster oven with a generous cooking chamber that excelled in almost every cooking task. Also great, Breville Smart of Nair Fryer. A close runner up to the Calphalon, this unit had all of the same winning ingredients, including a standalone fry basket, a simple, intuitive interface with manual knobs and dials, and an impressive air fry function. While the original Breville Smart of Nair Fryer is a more mid-sized machine at a lower price point, we found in testing the Breville Smart of Nair Fryer Pro is worth the extra money and space it occupies. The digital interface makes it an intuitive machine with 13 preset functions including air fry, slow cook, roast, broil, bake, cookies, pizza, toast, bagel, reheat, proof, dehydrate, and warm. The rack levels are printed right on the door for ease of use. This model does a preheat cycle for most settings, which is an additional step and takes a few extra minutes, but it adds a level of precision in the cooking not seen in many of the other machines. This did every task perfectly and in a short amount of time. It has a spring-loaded door, which takes a minute to get used to, but then is a nice feature. Like the original Breville Smart of Nair Fryer, it comes with a 13-inch non-stick pizza tray, wire rack, broiling rack, 9 by 13 enamel roasting pan, air fry basket and crumb tray and has additional accessories for purchase. Bamboo cutting board, pizza stone and pizza crisper pan. The oven will also fit standard 9 by 13 casserole dishes and a quarter sheet pan which gives it versatility to cook many things. You could also fit a standard 5 quart Dutch oven in this machine, if you wanted to. It also comes in several finishes so can really be purchased to match your kitchen and decor. The Ninja Foodi 10-in-1 XL Pro Air Oven DD 201 did a good job of air frying Brussels sprouts, chicken wings, breaded chicken, and homemade French fries, but was poet frozen French fries. It roasted a whole chicken beautifully and produced a satisfactory result when broiling burgers. It excelled when it came to baking a cake and cookies, 
and it reheated a frozen pizza perfectly. White bread was toasted up evenly, but bagels didn't brown as well. The Ninja automatically goes into a preheat mode which is always just 1 minute and 30 seconds. Once the preheat is up, it automatically starts to count down the cooking time so you have to have your food ready before you start preheating. Like all toaster of air fryers, the Ninja comes with a shallow air frying basket for cooking a single layer of food at a time. Although it didn't receive perfect scores for air frying Brussels sprouts, homemade French fries, panko crusted chicken breasts, and chicken wings, it did brown and crisp the majority while keeping them moist and tender. It's worth noting that some pieces were dry inside however. Using the whole roast setting, we roasted a whole chicken in just 50 minutes. It came out golden brown and crispy on the outside and delectably moist and tender on the inside. We cooked for 4 ounce hamburgers on the broil setting and didn't get the kind of browning we'd expect from broiling, although the burgers came out juicy. The ninja really shone at baking a yellow cake in a 9 inch pan. The cake came out well risen with a golden brown top and a moist and tender crumb. Chocolate chip cookies took surprisingly long to bake 15 minutes and came out only lightly browned, but were moist and delicious inside. A frozen 12-inch pizza came out absolutely perfect, on top it was lightly browned with evenly melted cheese, and the bottom was crisp. The Ninja has a unique setting called Dare Roast which is designed for cooking two foods at once on two different tracks. On the bottom rack, Using the roast tray set on a sheet pan, we cooked two one-pound pork tenderloins, while on a high rack, in the air fryer basket, we cooked two pounds of broccoli. In just 35 minutes, the pork came out browned as well as moist and tender, and the vegetables lightly browned and tender crisp. The Ninja Foodie XL Pro Air of Indeedy 201 gives you lots of functionality, and because of its innovative design, it was the easiest to use of all of the toaster ovens we tested. It does everything from toasting bread, to heating frozen pizza, to baking, and roasting perfectly. Plus, it can air fry which means you get the functionality of several appliances in one package. Compared to our winning toaster oven, the Breville Smart of Nair Fryer Pro, the Ninja scored better for cooking chicken wings and toast, however the Breville was better with frozen french fries. The overall score was close though, and the Ninja is $100 cheaper, making it well worth your consideration. The 10-in-1 Instant Omni Plus Air Fryer Toaster Oven is an excellent kitchen companion. It's overall easy to use and cooks up delicious and consistent results, but the appliance runs a little noisy and gets hot. I've found that most toaster ovens these days built with air fryers have a feature that will set them apart from their competitor, but then they can be more or less the same. The Instant Omni differentiates itself with its large LED touch screen and rotisserie feature, while the KitchenAid digital countertop oven requires no flipping and has a proof setting. For more examples, Ninja's Foodie Flip Oven is space-saving, while Fotile's Chef Kubi added steam capabilities to create a product unlike any other. The rotisserie feature is a unique option, but the verdict is really up to you if it's a feature you'll use. For myself, I found it messier and more time-consuming than just picking up a rotisserie at the grocery store but it did come out undeniably superior. For daily use, the Instant Omni Plus is reliable and cooked food consistently every time. For longer cooking sessions, I did find that I needed to grab an oven mitt just to open the door as the handle got hot. Also, during the cool down period following an air fry or reheating, the appliance itself was quite grumbly. It might not have bothered me so much if I wasn't staying in the kitchen eating what had just been prepped. If you're space challenged in the kitchen the and want one multitasking product, 
rather than several, the Cuisinart Tear Fryer Toaster Oven can fill the bill as long as you don't want to use it for baking. Unlike other toaster ovens we tested, it can't substitute for a full-size oven when it comes to turning out cookies, cake, and even frozen pizza. Although it doesn't tear fry quite as well as a dedicated air fryer, it can also be used to make your morning toast and roasts of all kinds. The Cuisinart is a good-looking appliance that you won't mind having permanently sitting on your countertop. It's easy to use, but a little challenging to clean. Be wary of how hot the glass door gets through, and make sure it's out of reach of children.